everybody. Today we are starting off the vlog in the bedroom this morning. So Pia's been doing a bit of tummy time. Oh look, she's trying to turn. Go on Pia. Go on. Go on. Are you trying to get your dummy? You do a little turn. Go on then. Go on then. You little drib dribble monster. I don't know if she saw herself in that. She I know. <laughs> We did do some tummy time this morning and now um, Pia's just, what well, seems like she's trying to turn on her side. Um, I absolutely love this sleep suit. This one is from Baby Mori, I think it's called. Their material is so good and so thick, so it keeps Pia nice and warm. Doesn't it? Did you have a nice sleep? Did you have a nice sleep? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> yeah? <sighs> Boom. Uh boo. Uh boo. Pretty girl. What's that? What's that? You two interested in the camera? So her new thing is she's figured out what her feet are. So she can touch her feet. She's always playing with her feet, aren't you? You're always touching your feet. Are you going to show us now? <coughs> Bless you! Are you going to touch your feet? Look! What's this? Okay, so I thought I would take this moment to show you guys what I picked up from Prime, Primark. So I've got two bags here. Um, I also bought new bedding as well, but I've already popped that on the bed. So I'll show you that. I'll insert like a little video here so you guys can see what that looks like. But I wanted to get a few things for the house because now autumn's arrived. I wanted to bring more of like the brownie um, tones into my house. So the first thing I picked up was this massive candle. And this smells so nice. This is in the scent Peony. And this was £10. Yeah, so this whole candle was £10. I think it's so affordable for such a huge candle that it's probably going to last me forever. So I like that. When me and Ben were like smelling the scents and we was umming and ahhing about which one to go for. But we ended up going with Peony. The next thing I picked up was this fro. Absolutely loved the material of this and how soft it is. And just the cosy vibe that it was giving me. I thought this would be perfect just on the sofa behind me as well. Just to cosy up to uh, maybe even the bedroom. This could look cute. But no, actually I think I'm going to put this one in the living room. I, yeah, just love it. How much was this? This was £14, which hopefully it's not going to be as small, but for £14, yeah, it's not too bad. It's not too bad, but we'll see what it looks like once I've opened it all up. I'm going to put everything out um, afterwards and show you guys where I've placed everything. So I picked up that. I did pick up just one clothing item, just because as I was going up to the homeware section, I saw these, which were actually in the sale, I think, um, and they're just these brown trousers. Very light linen vibes, wide leg. Um, but I've tried these on already and they don't fit me. They are too big. So I need to take these back, see if they've got a smaller size because I just thought these were so nice and they'd be perfect for this time of year. Um, yeah, just easy. I love like easy, quick outfits. I love the outfit that I'm wearing today. This is actually a play suit from Pretty Little Thing. I'll show you properly once I'm stood up. It's really nice. Um, puffy sleeves. Yeah, I'll link it down below if you guys are interested. So next up, I picked up this fro. This one is a lot bigger than the other one. This one is a lot smaller. Um, yeah, I love this. I just thought this would be perfect just to cozy up to in the evening. I love the brown tones. As I said, I wanted to bring more of that brownie, earthy sort of shades, um, like autumnal shades, more into the house. Now the seasons are changing. So I saw this, definitely more warmer in the inside, which I love. And this one was £16, so just £2 more than the other one, which I love. They've got so many fros in at the moment. I usually cannot wait for more of like the Christmas fros because I think I had that red one, which you guys may have seen if you watch my YouTube channel with Aish. Um, I used to literally bring that out every single year, but that has now gone in the bin because I think I had that for about 
three or four years and it was starting to just wear a bit and I was just like okay ready for like, I'm ready for like a refresh so I think when Christmas time comes back around and if they bring that one back in I'm definitely going to repurchase it because it's done me well it's done me well and I really want to I love just like that tartan red print especially at Christmas time to pick up some cushions to pop on the sofa just um just to give some more color to it because right now it's pretty bare I did have some pillows from Primark previously but I've sort of I took them off quite a while ago because I just wasn't really feeling them and then I saw these pillows in there and I love them so this is what they look like quite beigey on the back which if you really wanted to I guess you could put them that way round um but obviously they are meant to be this way round as you can see that's the pattern of them I love that they're still cream just with a touch of like that beige so it still goes really well with the sofa without like just overpowering it because I am quite a basic person like I like things to just be quite minimal in my house so yeah I love these I ended up picking up three of these and they cost um nine pounds so I'm quite happy with them I think what I may do also is get like another one that's just like a random other one just to go on the sofa because my sofa I don't know if it picks up like that on camera but it's actually really really big um so definitely room for more um, pillows. One thing with my sofa, I get so many questions on my sofa. So this is actually from Oak Furniture Land and we got it, I think when we first moved in to the place just before this one, um, we placed an order but it does obviously take, if you don't know, it does take a while for sofas to be delivered. It literally can take months and I think we did wait months for this sofa. Um, would I recommend it? Right, comfy, is, this is the comfiest sofa I have ever sat on and I love my sofa so, 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 so much. It's actually like a teddy bear material, um, so you've got to be a little bit careful with it, which, hindsight, is it practical? Probably not, um, but I love it so much and we've added these froze on top just to protect the sofa a bit more, just you know, just in case. I love my sofa so much though. Um, I would recommend it. I love it so much. If you're, you've got to obviously be careful because it is white. Um, I've tried to find the link before and I cannot find it, but it is from Oak Furniture Land and we just went into a store in Norwich and picked it up from there. But that's the story on the sofa. Last week we actually went to my mum's and then we also nipped over to Ben's mum's also because they actually both live in Yorkshire so we like to do both of them at the same time because it is quite away from our house. So when we went up there we actually went to a outlet centre which is near Ben's mum's and they had a Yankee candle store in there so I thought I would go in there and check out the candles. This candle me and Ben get every single year which is the snowflake cookie. We've been getting this since we first got together. I don't think we actually, did we get it last year? I don't actually know if we got it last year, but every other year we've always had this candle. So it's like weird bringing it back out. And then obviously like this will be the first year that we have it whilst having Pia. So this is definitely my favorite Christmas scent, which is Snowflake Cookie. Let me know down below what your favorite Christmas scent is. I know it's super early, but I'd love to know. Do you like more of like the cinnamony sort of smell or the cookie smell? Gingerbread. I don't personally like the cinnamon scents. I think they smell so strong and I'm not a fan, but I know my mum absolutely loves that scent. But I'm the complete opposite. I like the baking sort of smells. They're the smells that I absolutely love. When we was there actually, we picked up quite a few bits from Next and Sainsbury's and picked up some things from both of those stores. So I might actually quickly show you, give you guys a little bit of a haul of what we picked up.
I just finished doing a little bit of baking. I don't even know if you can call that baking because I basically just used this. Um, I saw this in my cupboard when I was organising it, which you guys would have seen in the last vlog. And I thought, well, I should probably make that because I've had this for a while now. Um, so I thought I would give it a go. I added some chocolate chips to mine on top. And it's so quick and easy as well. You literally just add some eggs. Um, but I do want to start and bake some more stuff, obviously, from scratch. Um, I've been saving some stuff that I've seen on TikTok, so I am going to do a little bit of that as well at some point. Just because, you know, it's the season where everyone wants to just stay in and bake and just be cosy. And that's what I want to do. While I'm waiting for this to cook, because I've just popped it in the oven, I'm just going to, as I always do, just give the house a little bit of a clean over. And I think I'm going to start and sort through Pia's clothes because she is just growing so, so, so quick. And um, a lot of the stuff don't actually fit her now. So when I'm trying it on her, you can just tell her feet are like this now. I'm going to sort all those stuff out, just change it all around and put all of her new three to six months um, stuff in properly now because there was still a few of the um, like we had like the odd things that were a little bit big anyway that still fit her sort that all out so it's nice and organized and then that's one thing ticked off my list that I wanted to do hey gorgeous did you just wake up from your nap we're a bit zoomed in are we gonna get you ready? Are we gonna get you ready? <gasps> Hi! Is these your toys? Hmm? Oh! What's that? You wanna hold it? There you go. Wow! What's that? Then she forgets about it. This is what she does. She holds on to her feet now. That's what you do. Go on then. Go on then. So, yeah? What's that particular descendant? Gorgeous. Hi. Every time I say hi, all I think of now is bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. <laughs> you <good>? Bye. <laughs> yeah, literally, that's all I think of. Shall I go and pick you a nice outfit to wear for today? Okay, so Ben's gonna pick Pia an outfit and then I'm gonna dress her while he sorts himself out and has a shower. Guys, the brownies smell insane, so our house smells so nice at the moment. Mm, beautiful. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get Pia dressed. I can get you dressed. She look beautiful. Sit down. You, you stiff board. <laughs> Mummy's just packed your backpack. So we're gonna go out and we're gonna go to Asda. Do you want to go to Asda? Yeah? Of course she does. Picked up these um, dummy holders because um, Pia always just spits her dummy out um, yeah. when she's out and about. So we don't like it when she drops it. Which is annoying. And I've seen a few other babies and stuff have these before. Do, do they last? Because I feel like when I've clipped that on her before, it just falls off. I don't know if no, I'm No, you just got to do it tight. Tight eye, yeah. Do you want to have daddy's fingers? Yeah, look. Let's do it like that and then just go really tight. <laughs> oh my God, I've been dying to sneeze for ages and it keeps disappearing. Oh, got it. Should we make a move? What have you got in your pockets then, Pia? You got some bags in there. Have you got some, you got some sweeties? Yeah. You got some sweeties in your pockets? What do you want to have for dinner tonight? Swag bowl. Guys, I got my bags. I'm trying to be good because it irritates me so much when I forget my bag, so I've got them. Let's go. Woohoo! Are you enjoying your trolley ride? Are you enjoying it? In Asda, we are just getting some bits for um, the next few days. I think we're going to London next week, so um, <laughs> we always just buy a minimum. Yeah, we just buy a minimum, like honestly, because our plans change all the time, so we just never know what to do. We will be um, 
Do we look smart today? We're like matching. Yeah, we are. We all kind of match. Beer's wearing linen as well. We've, We've got all like got linen the, um, on. The earthy tones on. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we're going to go to London next week, so we're just going to get a few bits for the next few days. Okay, she always just sits there so good, she doesn't cry or anything, she loves being in the trolley rides. But we're just about done. Pia got a bit bored, so that's why she's asleep. And just getting rid of her naught to one, one to two, because to be honest, I've been a bit slack and I've just had it all muddled all together. So this section here and this section here, what I absolutely love about it is literally it's gender neutral. So literally I can use this for my next baby as well, which is absolutely perfect because I'm all about reusing as well, which I have no problem with that. So I think that's going to be perfect. So definitely going to bag these up and save these and then these are just her long sleeves that I'm just sorting through now and then I just saw stuff like this which is still in like her size and I saw this for example and I thought oh, would she still be able to wear this and I thought if I just pair this with some tights this would still probably be okay so I think I'm gonna still keep these bits out um, I'm just gonna go through keep going through her stuff Hopefully see a progress because I'm so tired today. I don't even know why. Um, but yeah, let's keep it going. So cute getting out all of the bigger sizes now for her. Because I remember when I first got this ages ago. This is from the White Company. And I was like, oh my God, this is going to be so cute when I can see her in there. So it's nice to know like she's growing. And yeah, it's be cute to see her in this. Wow, I remember picking this up when Pia wasn't even born. This is from Zara. Oh my god, it's bringing back so many memories. It's so crazy. Um, yeah, this this is still a little bit big for her. I think it's just like the arms and it's three to six. Um, but I think with like a light, with um, a long sleeve of white um, bodysuit underneath and then with some tights. I don't know, the weather is so hit and miss at the moment. We're still getting quite a few hot days, but to be honest, I'm kind of ready that the season is changing and there's rain coming. Um, but yeah, I still do absolutely love this. It's so cute. I always thought oh, the rompers was definitely something that I wanted to dress Pierre in because I just think they are adorable. Another beautiful top from Zara. This is still big for her, but oh my God, this is going to look adorable when it fits her. How pretty is this? Just with like a pair of like leggings or something underneath. So cute. We got this little set from um, Zara and it is the cutest thing ever. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have seen the picture that I posted with Mila and Pia wearing matching little tracksuits. Honestly, Zara I feel like do like the best baby clothes and um, probably not like the newborn but i feel like when they get to about three to six upwards they're very very good um so i definitely feel like i'm going to be getting a lot more of these like tracksuit style um sets from zara now the weather is getting a lot colder another place i really really recommend is h&m i really like the h&m clothes and sainsbury's i think uh, to be honest of the supermarkets i feel like do really affordable reasonable um like little um leggings and stuff as well because i've got a lot of them from like george and i feel like they're just perfect and so easy okay i'm just moving on to baby grays and i don't know why but it always makes me feel so much more emotional because i feel like these were the sort of first things that i saw peer in and it's now like i don't know it's like weird to think like these were all of her like newborn items like clothes and yeah, the newborn stage is just completely gone. And when people say the newborn stage goes so quick, it honestly does. Like, genuinely, I can't even remember that much from it. It went that quick. But I used to love putting Pia in this, but I feel like she's getting to the stage where that just does not fit her anymore. But these are from the White Company, and so is this. Do you remember when Pia used to fit into these? Yeah. Isn't it so sad, like, to think how quick that time has gone? It's crazy. It's so crazy. Just near the end now, and I think I'm just going to... Stop, because I feel like I'm, I've, I've basically nearly done everything, but there's still a few bits that I need to go through, like just a few more of the baby grows and stuff, and I've just done a whole, whole load of washing. 
Um, so yeah. Got Pia changed into her PJs for tonight. She yeah. Gorgeous. Yeah. She looked gorgeous. You can't see her, can't face. See her face. There we go. Are you looking at mummy? Are you looking at mummy? Oh, gorgeous. Let me have a kiss. Kisses. Mwah. Love you. That's a cute little outfit. We got these from Next. Um, there was like a pack of four. And it's so cute because when Pia was first born, we also we bought these, these didn't we? Yeah. And we bought them in Tiny Baby. Talk to us if you can. We bought them in Tiny Baby. And now, these are three to six months. Our baby is growing up. So we picked up a few bits the other day. Um, loads of um, new, uh, what are these? Like long sleeve bodysuits. Obviously we're going to stick these in the wash. Um, anyway. So we've got the bunny rabbits, leaves. Which is my favourite, it's so autumnal, so I can't wait to wash them. I should Cute. put them all in the washing And then there's minute. a grey one, which I like, because I, I don't really ever see like baby clothes in like black and grey, do you? Mm. Which is quite cool. And then there's a teal one, which is the same colour as my Vans t-shirt, if you've seen that. Well, this as well, so you've got navy, gr uh, like a light grey, and then a khaki, and then a light blue, and then a sort of pinky beige. And we've got these ones, which are more long sleeve bodysuits. These ones are from Sainsbury's. Yeah, Sainsbury's, these ones. Um, and then, yeah, some other cute pattern ones and ones that says that little love thing on it. Oh, beautiful. Um, what else did we get? We've got some really good stuff in the next sale. There's two of these, so they're like that with a nice frilly collar. And then it comes in that colour as well. Um, so we got so we had to get loads of new clothes for Pia because she's starting to grow out um, of uh, old stuff. We do have quite a bit that people bought us when she was first born anyway, um, like three to six and older. Um, but yeah, we've got this one here as well. That's my favourite one. Is it? Yeah. This, card, this cardigan with little dots on it, little coloured dots, which is quite cute. We, had to get, um, we wanted to get some warmer stuff for her for when um, it gets a bit chilly because the weather's still a bit humid at the moment. And then, um, you probably saw these on Zell's Instagram the other day, but um, we've got some Trek Trek. Go suits. on, you can do them pretending to be me, it was so funny. You like it babe? <laughs> babe, do you like it? Oh my god, it's so cute. Look at that smile. I don't realise how much I say babe. I babe say babe cute. so much, and cute. Babe Cute's and cute. my babe. Everything to me is so cute. So this is like track suit, which is cute, and then we've got that in a grey. The This colour. I'm not sure what the grey one is. Grey one's in the bedroom, I think. Grey ones, uh, beige ones, and then it comes in colour would you say this is? Like greeny blue? Like a mint. Like a, mint, like a yeah. mint, yeah. Which is cute. <laughs> really cute, in it, babe? Psyche. No, I don't have an Essex accent. No, I know. This is having the last of her little bit of milk. She's a bit tired. Yeah, she is tired. She does this yeah. thing where she gets tired and she goes like this. You're so cute. <laughs> So, um, what was we saying? The new changes we have from Pia is she now touches her feet. Yeah, she grabs hold of her feet, so she's laying down, she's like holding on to her feet. Um, but you're a big girl now. She's doing a bit more laughing, aren't you? Pia. She's so smiley. Pia. Hello. Hey. Say hello. She loves her hands, though. Oh, she loves her hands. And she's very dribbly now. Yeah. That's a new update. Very yeah. dribbly. We're going to end up the video here. We really hope you guys enjoyed it and we hope to see you in our next vlog. Bye! Peace! Just say bye, Pia. Bye! Bye! We are shattered. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Hi, gorgeous. Are you looking at the camera? We'll sit down, eat some food, watch some telly. Zelly has never seen um, Wally, -E, so we're gonna watch that. Is it the thing that's like Wally? -E? Yeah, the robot. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure you smash it a big thumbs up. Leave any comments down yeah. below, and we will see you soon in our next video.